News just in. Another set of state of public emergency has been declared across several parishes in the island of Jamaica by its Prime Minister, Andrew Holness. The SOEs are in the parishes of St. Anne, Clarendon, St. Catherine, St. James, Westmoreland, Hanover and parts of Kingston and St. Andrew. The Henan's security measures follows the ending of a previous SOE on December 20. The SOEs will last for an initial 14 days. The announcement was made a short while ago by Prime Minister Andrew Holness. He says the threat level against Jamaicans remains elevated. Yeah, man. On the spot news media, we got the latest news. We don't care about the views. We just represent and right. Put local news internationally every night. On the spot, wave that Jamaican flag from left to right. Let's get it right. Y'all know the type. We ain't dealing with the hype. We make it take flight. Yeah, man, my viewers and subscribers, what a uh, guan, a blessed and wonderful Wednesday morning to each and every person out there tuning into On The Spot News Media. Now, my peeps, you don't know how we do it over on this side each and every morning. We have to give thanks and praise to the Most High Creator for the preservation of life because life is indeed the greatest. So to all of the ones and ones them traversing out there in the streets trying to enjoy the rest of this Yuletide season, Please, you don't know, be careful. Continue to look out on a corner, yeah, because the old dirty corner boy, them always out there, alerts. So, in you know, the morning, I'm a peeps, we got traversed through the streets of the troubled, war torn, crime riddled Kingston Western Police Division. So on the spot news media would have covered a knockings and clappings which resulted in the loss of life of a 47 year old man known as David Rowe but popularly known in the streets as Smokey Joe. Now this knockings and clappings which resulted in the loss of life of Smokey Joe took place approximately three and a half weeks ago in the community of Jonestown which is located in the General Arnett Gardens era of the Kingston Western Police Division. Now on your screen is the two vlogs that I covered that knockings and clappings extensively. So if you have not tuned in to these blogs, please go over and watch these blogs so you can get a full and a better understanding of what took place. Now the Kingston Western Police has arrested and charged the alleged Nakis and Clappis in the last life of the 47 year old bearer known as David Rowe but popularly called Smokey Joe. The alleged Nakis and Clappis in that incident has since been identified by the police as 22-year-old Giovanni Thompson. He's of a Woodward Street address in Kingston 12, Jonestown. Now, Giovanni Thompson is popularly known in the criminal underworld as Little Pops, presently on your screen right now. So, let me give you a quick synopsis of what took place. The incident happened along Septimus Street on November 30. Reports from the Denham Town Police is that about 11.10 p.m. Roe, that is Smokey Joe, was at home on Septimus Street when he was allegedly called out by Thompson, which is Little Pops, who other men also accompanied to take his life. Now an argument developed and it is alleged that Little Pops pulled a firearm from his waistband and opened gunfire, hitting Rose several times all over his body. The police was summoned and Smokey Joe, that is Mr. Rowe, was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced you know what. Little Pops was however arrested in Manchester shortly after. He was charged by detectives at the Denham Town Police Station on Monday afternoon. So now see what we are talking about my peeps. The criminal elements continues to cross borders into these rural 
parishes. So another job well done again by the squad of them. <laughs> yeah, man. And still in the troubled, war torn, crime riddled Kingston Western Police Division. This time paying particular attention to the war torn era of Denham Town. A man end up get can up yesterday morning in the wee hours about 4.30 a.m. at the corner of North Street and Milk Lane. Now the person in question is presently on your screen. He is known only at this time as Deanie Ross. He doesn't sport a dreadlocks presently. But he got that name Dini Ras because he used to be a Rastafari back in the days. Now it is said that some men can him up. Bilius, I got a small clipping and you can see where the door was kicked in and it seems as if he was behind the door trying to prevent his attackers from gaining entry to his house. The attackers opened fire through the wooden door and can him up leaving him slumped right at the door lifeless now it is widely said in the streets that men known as bling dog breads and bull are the perpetrators of that crime so anyone knowing the whereabouts of bling dog breads or bull from the denham town area is to contact the denham town police cib and furnish them with that information as those persons can definitely help the police to close this loss of life so the knockings and clappings my peeps continues <laughs> yeah man now my peeps we are gonna give an in-depth look and report into the loss of life of a bearer some persons would call them delivery men. Those men who rides their bikes to make deliveries of various kinds. And of course you pay them for their services. Now this particular delivery guy lost his life in one of the most brutal and horrific way possible for anyone to lose their lives. Now his family members and friends described his loss of life as one of torture. So be like Michelangelo right now and paint that graphic imagery in your mind. And that is exactly what that loss of life consisting of torture look like. Now he was reported missing on the 23rd of December between the hours of 4 and 5 p.m. He went to make a delivery in the Caribbean Estate housing complex over there in Portmore, St. Catherine. Now it is alleged that his life was set up by a female which you will have the chance to have a glimpse of who she is in short order because there has been a voice note that has been circulating on social media that tells the tales of what may have happened or what really had happened to that particular bearer now on your screen is the bearer in question his birth name, his given name is Roger Griffiths. Now it is said that Roger Griffiths went to deliver a polo slides to a particular female. However, it is alleged that the slides were fake. Now it is said that the woman in question demanded a full refund. So we are going to hear from that particular female right now. And if that particular female is listening presently, you can contact on the Spot News Media. Reach out to me via Instagram or email on Instagram on the Spot News Media 876 or my email is on the Spot News Media at gmail.com. So reach out to me if you're listening to this newscast because i am rather interested to hear your take or your side 
of the story as it relates to the disappearance of Roger Griffiths leading up to his loss of life. The police found his body in an advanced state of decomposition with several chops, bruises and stab stab up wounds all bow time body. He was tortured as his family members would have made mention. Now listen to these voice clips and please my peeps drop some comments in the comment section and we can reason about it. Don't so listen. Because him deal with a business to me yesterday, you know. You know, so me I blame you because a year store me didn't want to support the first place and buy things from me, you know. But you care, me do not care that food system come, you know, where it pissed me off in you know, the first place. And I said, no, I yes, come buy shoes from that place at two times. Brother, two times, but not Panda account here. I buy shoes from me already. Nike, everything, brother. And and the man come right when the man come in the next place, go buy one polo slides. Come tell say it's for a gift. No buy a gift for my man. It's a polo slides. My man, in care the fucking sun come. The big box right and the the slippers. It's stiff enough, but I'm made in a China. You know real. The box is that them glue and the pro the polo sign pan it. The pussy go tell me say. My ask him I call to him. Say I go come to him right. He man go like him a body man like him free than the man. I go tell me about oh um. Him, him call the man and the man say him can't do nothing. What the f What you mean by what you mean by you can't? And they must have worked, they must have fucked together. Bet you can't. Yeah, do business. But pay him every time him come back. And I'm more than one time the man come to me still pay him. I'm not ask. Child, this is I'm not like them fuck right. I'm gonna make me know say him can't. Cut him the man now go change about the thing, brother. Fuck you mean by I pay my money. I remember I tell you, the bike boy they are going to fuck with me. I want the mad girl them with their road here. And my people them don't play. So I say, no, I give him my fucking things. He better change him number. And you know him. Tell him to change him number or so. Because if he thinks that, oh, we're not smart, we're going to make him deal with so, him better blood clap pray. Because I say, anyway, he think he might go. And I don't know, say, I did it. I did it. I did it. So I'm asking him, say, yo, because he's cool, you know. I say, yo. Give me a wish for where the place is. I go walk the whole half a tree. I make me know, say, yo, the place is not a name. Come here, fucking there. The man in the video called me in the store yesterday. You know? He won't go tell me, say, the store is not no name. What the fuck you mean by the store, though, have no name? And I can move like, I make me eat, man, I move like them, I push it towards a woman. I never beg you, I never sell you my friend, I never do none of that, brother. I pay you my money, pan spot. Give me my things, I ask for someone. Make me decide if I want to fake one or not. I don't want to wear a bomb, period. My man don't wear a bomb, period. I support your business, you can't give me what I want. It's up to you to say, yo, mama, I'm going to charge you an extra five or ten grand for the real, real thing, you know. Because I'm going to put them of the real things, they're at the back, you know. Them things, you idiot. Remember, I'm telling you, you know. I call the man him down answer. Me say, yo, brother, make some me in the summer. Just talk to the man. Alright, you, you, you know what give me? Give me my money, work, you know, everything. More the clothes, more shoes, more more no shoes, more pants, more everything. And call it quit. No me have got call bumbo club police. I made the whole he might come go around me like send me and some eat and I play play with me. Tell me what the place there. Him now forget involved in cause him do me nothing, you know. Some say ah cool, tell me what the place. Him I work with the man. Cause you know, so when him call me, tell me say I'm 12, when he meet him, tell him I'm 13, but me, I have my money. I say, no, I'm cool. But I know, say, he might charge me extra, my man, I say, no, cause he don't know who the fuck he might play with, you know. The man, I got me, he don't know who know me, you know, or who know my people, them you know. But listen, you know, tell him, say, I want my things, just carry, come give me, cause I'm going to make police stop. Say, bet my man, my uncle stop him by on the road, brother, and, 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 him, and him take with that. Say, bet. Tell him don't play with me. I just want my things. I just want my things. I know you don't know where I'm getting from or whatever. But you must know him. I just want to know where his name or what brother. Because I'm not running a job. I just want my things. I don't want a problem. I just want it. That's all. He not know bad. He might come go and like say, yo, he's hard for... He's hard for... He's the delivery. You know, so them you turn on a style. Better you give out the woman the money, brother, but you want to come get mad because you rob somebody. 
a liar tell can want every saint. Adopt me, I tell you. And since you want to trick me, watch this. Since since him so bad, make me stop the ear. Since him so bad, him want to go there, so watch this. Him, <clears throat> him himself no say the number not work. If him now call him, what we go over this? Him and me, we go over this over and over when him can solve the problem. If the car now got you a block in a TV ring. Period. We now get the number. What you do is you tell me where the place is. Are you go there? With the man now on time phone. You go the place. You gonna get no way. Him know exactly where him got here yesterday, brother. Him and the man. I him tell him say him know the man like so and so. So him come talk about contact. Me now get the man. The man block the number. I him not nobody call him. We cannot get him. Go there then and get back my things. Why am I make it so hard? Like him afraid. Him afraid. I'm send a screenshot of the, the, the since then I believe me, in video called me in the store when he did a buy the slippers. As in me see when he my buy it, then show me the slippers and everything. So he show me the store itself. Like people in the store close everything dead here. And I like I want oh I just want to look a con away. You know what I mean? It I, regardless him can go back there. If I want corner, I want to carry them myself it from, I want to want suitcase, him can go back there. Them not to him call, fine. Go back there. Regardless if I somebody you know or not, I'm money this brother. I'm making it sound like a begging beg the man. I'm money. If I did film things, he would have go for it. So my man want to tell me the food from my ears, brother. I beat my beat on the bush cause I'm know. And yo. Him call me, I go to right now and say. I got to carry the money come give me. I got to buy about the slides from him. What are 12 of them up? My mom will tell us, you know, the money tell me say 12 feet, and when I come, him say 13. Plus the delivery, you know. But him say I got to buy it back. So, we are going to see. So now, my peeps, after listening to that set of voice clips, tell me what you think went on after he bought back the slides from that female and do you really think that she had an hand into the loss of life of roger griffiths anyway my peeps remember if you like share subscribe to the channel stay tuned to on the spot news media as i continue to bring you fresh news and updates in subsequent newscast on the spot news media yeah man